Okay, it's Mr. Rops here, and today we have a quadratic with this root and with this 3 plus i root. We want to determine the equation. Well, the fact that I do not know if b and c are real, actually I know they're not going to be real because I do not have a pair. It's possible this could happen, but then b and c are probably going to be uh, unreal numbers, so complex numbers. So in order to do it, there's a couple ways we could do it. I'm just going to go on, this is going to be minus 1 minus 2i, put it into factored form, x minus 3 minus i, and when I rearrange it, I can take off my parentheses, x minus 3 plus i, and then I'm going to just churn it out, I'm just going to multiply all the terms out, and so I get x squared, x times, I get minus 3x, and then an, an xi, and then I go to the next term, I get negative x plus 3 minus i, and then a 2ix plus a 2ix minus 6i, and then a plus 2i squared, 2i squared. Well, x squared, I have an x, an x, an x, a 2i, so I'm going to put these together, I get negative 4x, and the xi's, I have plus 3xi, and then I have a 3, an i, uh, ooh, I got a 3 and a 2i squared, so that's a minus 2, so 3 minus 2 is a plus 1. And then I also have down here, I have minus 7i. And so finally I can have x squared. If I pull out a factor of x, I have, I'll make it a plus x. And so then I have minus 4 plus 3i. And then plus 1 minus 7i. And so from here, I know my b would be minus 4 plus 3i, and my c from here would be 1 minus 7i. And that, we know, is our quadratic.